tell me, is it possible that I can rename files all of them at the same time without going to them one by one? Oh yes, it's possible. Let me show you how to do that. This is how you will do it. So when you see all these files in a folder, maybe probably you want to rename them and add a specific text to each name. So uh, if you look at this number of files here at the bottom, they are 3,500 and you can't rename them one by one. It will take you forever. So now I'm using an app called Power Automate. So you can download this or you can find it running already if you are using Windows 11. But it's an app that you can also download and install on your computer. So what will happen now is that I will have to use this app to run an automated program that will do that work for me to rename all those 3000 files. So what I do, I have to cr create a new flow so i go to new flow i click there then i have to give it a name so let me just be specific and say renaming files when i create it will create it for me here to rename those files so then it will get all the things that i can use to run this automated program so as you can see it's getting things ready now it's open so the first thing that I have to do is to specify a folder that I want to put all those files that I want to rename. So here on the left, I will have to scroll up and down up until I see folder. Here on folder, you go and find get files in a folder. Drag and drop on an empty space like this. So it will open a screen like that. Then when it says folder here, we have to go and choose that folder that we know. So my folder is files which is on the desktop so i go to desktop i choose files when i click ok there it is now i go and say where it says file filter i just leave it like that i don't filter anything because i have to rename everything there now include subfolders i can activate it so that if there is a folder inside the main folder which is also having files which will be renamed then it can do that for me so now I click save okay so that is the first step the second step now is to go to the files so that now we can start the process of renaming so I go to rename files I drag and then I drop and then it will open a space or a screen for me to work on it so where it says files file to rename I have to choose the file to rename so now when you click here I can click here to select variable so when I click there you will see there's a variable files there that is the folder that we spoke about earlier so I can click it or double click it then you will see there it will specify that anything that is inside this file folder then it will be renamed so rename scheme how do I rename it set new name how do I want it so I want to add RSA like Republic of South Africa before those names so let me just open the folder again look at these files all these files they are having names on them so I just want to be uh, having I want them to be having a name before Mpumalanga that says RSA underscore Mpumalanga Keynes 101 and so on so what will happen is that when I come to that screen here I will have to specify how do I want to rename it I want to add text I don't want to remove the whole thing but I want to include some text on top of the name that is already there text to add then I can say RSA underscore you can use caps RSA underscore then here it says add text let's say before we can say after before the uh, name that is already existing okay so now there it is so I'm going to save this 
so all this now it's saved i need to run the script so let's look at the folder again so you see now there is no rsa before all these file names so now when i go back to my screen i click this button run when i click that run it runs in the background and then eventually is going to indicate there the bottom where it says status running you see then now it's finished so it means all my folders have been renamed according to what i've specified so i'm i'm expecting to see rsa to all the 3584 files so let me open them again there you see it's rsa all of them all the 3584 files they've been included with rsa so that is how you rename files which are many in a folder because you can't do them one by one thank you for watching remember to subscribe mm -hmm.